Hello friends, this is Veronica. You know what time it is. It's cafecito time and today I have a new little setup here. I wanted to try something different so let me know if you like the videos with this setup that I have here away from my kitchen in my table. Um, I have a little bit more counter space but um, just want to know your opinion if you guys like this setup that I'm doing here on my table or in my kitchen counter. So let me know, leave me a comment, and also make sure you have subscribed because we had a giveaway for our 100th video and I selected a winner and I'm gonna let you know who that winner is. The winner of that giveaway is Patsy Everhart. Congratulations, Patsy, you are the winner of the giveaway. So make sure you contact me with your information and I will send out your prize don't worry guys I have more giveaways coming up I have a couple ideas and plans uh, for some giveaways and don't forget when we hit a thousand subscribers we're getting pretty close there is going to be a Nespresso machine giveaway and I keep saying I'm gonna do this and I don't do it but I should make a video of the machine so you guys could see it and get an idea of what I'm gonna be giving away and you'll get motivated to subscribe so Go ahead and subscribe and we'll get started with today's video. So today's video, I want to talk about the holiday limited edition capsules from Nespresso. I did a video previously and I will link it below if you haven't watched that on the Nespresso holiday capsules for the original machine which was my KitchenAid the small capsules and today I just wanted to do a short video on letting you guys know about the Nespresso festive holiday capsules for the virtual line so um, if you're familiar with the Nespresso they have two lines of machines the original line which was the one that they first introduced many many years ago with the little capsules and then they have the virtual which is a newer somewhat newer line that uses the virtual capsules and this is one of the machines i have the virtual plus machine and there is a couple different designs but they all basically function the same with using the same capsules um, and for the holidays they have these three new capsules they're a little bit similar to the ones for the original line with the exception of one. So the original line had the Amoretti, which the Virtual does well. And this is the Amoretti flavor. I'll give you guys a little background here. Uh, it says why we love the Amoretti. Amoretti starts with the coffee cereal note and smooth texture onto this Latin American and African Arabica base. So this is the Amoretti, this pretty box. They also have in original and virtual, the El Cafe. And this is just a classic um, Italian coffee experience with the espresso. So for the original and virtual, you're gonna get the Amoretti and the Il Cafe. The different one for virtual is this one which is called pecan, pecan biscotti flavor. So if you want to try this one, you could only try it in the virtual line. For the original line, it was the um, Torta de Nicola, which was the hazelnut and vanilla flavor. So that's the difference between the original and the virtual machine is the pecan biscotti. So this is the capsules and I read a little bit of I read a little bit about them individually and this one um, for the original line all the capsules were eight dollars per box per sleeve these vary in price the Amoretti is $12.50 per box and this is what the capsules look like so they are much bigger and this capsule will give you a coffee a full-size cup of coffee which for Nespresso full size is 7.7 7 ounces almost 8 ounces so almost filling this cup up 
So it's a pretty gold and like a reddish orange color Amoretti flavor. And for the Nespresso Original and Virtual Line is also the same Il Cafe, which like I said, it's an espresso. And this is what it looks like. Il Cafe. This one is the same in both. Um, lines you get the 1.35 fluid ounces which is just one shot of espresso and that's what it looks like and this one is $11 so um, a little bit less for the Il Cafe espresso and for the pecan biscotti this is what it looks like it's um, so basically the capsules match the box the color the design, this one has like the turquoise color, teal color with the gold polka dots on it. You can see it. And this one will also give you a 7.77 ounces of coffee, a full cup of coffee. Um, and this one, um, I didn't read you the notes. Pecan biscotti flavor, you'll find a nutty note lifting the Latin American and African Arabicas, smooth cereal taste. So it gives you tasty notes, intensities. These are based off of Variations Italia for the Pecan Biscotti, the Amoretti flavor, and also for um, the Il Cafe, they do give you an intensity of 11. So it's pretty intense for an espresso. Um, and these are the flavors that are available from Nespresso for the holiday season. The only thing is these did um, get released earlier in the month of uh, November or late October. I don't remember. I'll put the date here it was released. But some of them have already sold out. And I do not know if Nespresso is going to um, have more stock on these or if it's a matter of if it's sold out it's gone for the season the il cafe is still available for virtual and so is the amoretti the pecan biscotti is gone from the website so that one is sold out if you didn't buy it i'm sorry i don't know if it's coming back um i hope it's coming back because you know we still have a long ways to go for the holiday season to be over uh, but that's what they look like and I have already tasted all of them and I'm going I'm not going to do individual taste tests today because I don't want to make the video super long um, but I have tasted all of them and I'll just give you my opinions so I'll start with my least favorite from this holiday season collection um, the Amoretti and the funny thing is that in the original line, the Amoretti flavor was actually one of my favorite ones. I really did like it, surprisingly. But the Amoretti in the virtual line, it's not as good. I'm disappointed because I was expecting the Amoretti flavor to be similar. But this one, they are artificially, artificially flavored. And with this one, you can taste the artificial flavor. With the original line, it does not taste really artificial. The Amoretti flavor is uh, pretty good actually. And I even uh, found a recipe to make um, cappuccino with the Amoretti and it's really, really good. This one, I was not very impressed. I didn't like it as much. The coffee flavor itself is very light and kind of weak. Uh, and the Amoretti has just a little bit of an artificial aftertaste, so I will not purchase these again. Um, it's not awful. It is drinkable. I am going to drink them, but they were not my favorite at all. So we are not, we are not buying these again. Um, my second least favorite, um, was the pecan biscotti. I was very excited when I read the flavor, I, the color alone sold me on the box i know sometimes we get sold on the pretty packaging um so yes i was sold on the pretty packaging and the flavor profile of this one sounded very very good um and the thing is it's not bad again it's just very light flavoring the flavor is 
not bold or strong. The coffee itself is kind of weak. So that was a little disappointing. Um, I did find a recipe to make this with some caramel. So that tasted really good. Milk, caramel, froth the milk, add some caramel. You make this one, it's pretty good. But when I drink this one, I feel like I still need to drink more coffee because the flavor is very light, um, not bold like some of the other ones that I, maybe I've just gotten used to some of the stronger, bolder flavors with Nespresso. Who knows? But anyways, so it's okay. I mean, I would purchase this again if it was available, but it's sold out, so I can't buy it again, which is okay. So this is not something I'm drinking daily. If I just want something light, kind of desserty coffee, then I could add some um, froth some milk, maybe add some caramel or other flavoring, whipped cream, and it'll taste good. So these are okay. The one I liked the best out of the virtual line is the Il Cafe. This one is really bold, tense, strong. It's the number 11 on the intensity level, but it gives you, according to them, just a classic Italian coffee experience. So if you were to go to Italy and have a, a coffee in a cafe, this is what it would be like, according to Nespresso. So um, what I do like about these is it makes a really good cappuccino. If you like cappuccinos or lattes, without like additional flavors, vanilla or um, hazelnut or just any flavoring. If you don't like that and you just want um, really good coffee flavor in your cappuccino, espresso in your cappuccino, then this is the one. It's actually really, really good. I also liked it in the original line, but from these three, this is the one I would repurchase. This is one you could probably drink year round. Um, and I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like. So again, I was sold with the packaging, the pretty dark navy color with the gold. Um, very nice. So this one is the price $11. Yes. So both of these were $12.50 per capsule per box. So that makes it $120 per capsule. And for the price, I just, like I said, was not very impressed, was not super duper happy. Um, Nespresso has a lot of their coffees for less that taste much better. So mm, honestly, I would recommend if you don't think you like these flavor profiles, skip these too and get this one. This one I think is a better deal. Um, 110 per capsule, so $11 per sleeve. Um, oh no, I just saw here on the website that the Amoretti is also out of stock. So no more Amoretti, no more Pecan Biscotti, but Il Cafe is still available. So let's make one of these to show you guys. There it goes. So I've been making pretty much cappuccinos with this one and they're very good. I froth my milk with, and I don't even add any sugar or extra flavoring, it's just the milk itself with this really bold, strong Il Cafe. So good. Highly recommend it. So there it is. You guys can see it. Pretty thick. You guys can see that. The crema is thick. See how it's coating, look. Coating. I don't want to spill it. It's coating the cup really, really good. Okay, so let's taste it. This is definitely gives you a punch when you drink it you get that punch in your mouth with the taste. It's actually really good. I normally don't drink shots of espresso, just plain with nothing in them, but this one, I think I can. Yeah, this is good. So 
definitely recommend it if you missed out. Don't worry, don't worry about these two. These are no longer available on the website. They might come back. So you just have to be checking the website because I have noticed some copies are out of stock and then within a month or two, couple weeks, they come back in stock. So keep checking if you want to try the Amoretti and the Pecan Biscotti. If you do not get to buy them, honestly, I don't think you're missing out. You're uh, probably better off buying other coffees, but the El Cafe is still available. I recommend you try it if you like bold, strong coffees um, and you wanna make some really yummy cappuccinos, get the Il Cafe. Highly recommended. And yeah, that's it. I think that's all I want to tell you guys about these coffees. Like I said, I didn't want to make the video super long trying all the coffees. I've already, um, you know, this one is almost done. I've already opened them and tried them all. Um, if you do not follow me on Instagram, you guys should follow me on Instagram. Same name, House of Sid. I've been doing a lot of reels, a lot of TikToks. Um, with some of these coffees and recipes. So if you are interested, you guys can go there. Follow me there. Uh, I'm more active in Instagram than I am on TikTok. But you could follow me on TikTok or Instagram. Same name, House of Sid. Like I said, there's a lot of uh, little videos I've been making. Um, reels, TikToks, or just um, some everyday behind the scenes coffee things there. So follow me there. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel as well. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Helps us grow. Share our videos if you know anybody that would be interested in our video or would like to know more about Nespresso. Share our videos because sharing is caring and we are in the season of sharing and caring for the holidays. Um, so yeah, and also let me know what you guys think of this new setup. If you like it, I'll make more videos. In this format if you like me being in the kitchen let me know leave me a comment so thanks everyone for watching and we'll see you next time bye